Hey guys, welcome back. It is your 15 minute full body workout today. We're gonna get right into this. Start down on your mat. We're gonna start with abs and then take it from there, okay? Starting with your hollow hold, just come all the way back down to your mat. Feet are coming about three inches off the floor. Shoulders come off your mat. And just brace your core here. Hold this, right? Engage with your belly, right? Start to wake up your abs. Push your heels toward the bottom wall, right? Relax your shoulders if you can. Bring your biceps up by your ears. We'll hold this for 20 more seconds, and then we're gonna take it right into our first set of bicycles, all right? Everything we do today is gonna be 30 seconds one, 30 seconds two, back to one, back to two, 30 seconds each, and then we'll move on to the next move, all right? And five, taking it into your bicycle crunch in three, two, and one. Alternate right knee, left elbow, left knee, right elbow, squeezing your abs, stay braced and pedal out your legs, right? It's as slow or as fast as you want it to be. Remember, you have the option to drop down and extend, right? If you wanna find a little bit more of a challenge rather than just holding and bracing. In 10 seconds, you're gonna come back up to your hollow hold, okay? Shoulder blades back off your mat. Abs should start to feel it, right? In three, two, and one, come up into your hollow hold, right? Just hold this here, option to bring your biceps up by your ears, we're almost there. <sighs> Try to bring your shoulder blades off your bat, off your mat, right? Relaxing your shoulders down away from your ears. <sighs> 15 to go, one more round of bicycles, all right? In 10, right knee, left elbow, in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go get this. 30 seconds on with your bicycles before we take it up into our seated position, all right? If you need that moment to recover, make it quick. 15 seconds left. Option to slow it down a little bit if you want to. We got five. Coming up to your seated position, four. Three, two, and one. Right from here, if you can keep your feet off the ground, that's great. We have our Russian twist, just rotating from side to side, right? Over to the right, back to the left. Your modification here is to keep your feet on the floor, right? Start to engage with your obliques. Bring your elbow all the way across your body, but keep your shoulders square, right? Keep your chest proud. Spread your collarbone. Shoulders stay relaxed. In five, we're dropping back to our shoulder blades. We have our glute bridges, right? Drive down through your heels in three, two, and one. Shoulder blades on your mat, squeezing your glutes at the top. Come up and hold. We drop it right back down. Squeeze and drop. Heels on the floor, right? Wrap this around to your glutes, to your lower back, up and down. Lift your hips up to the ceiling, right? Lift up and drop. 10 to go, coming back up to your seated position, right back into our Russian twists. In three, two, and one. Right back into your Russian twists, right elbow across your body, left elbow to your opposite thigh. Fifteen seconds, and then we're taking it right back to your glute bridges, okay? Heels on the floor, hips up to the sky in ten. We're almost there. We're almost there. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Heels on the floor, shoulder blades on your mat. Squeeze up and drop. Lift and lower. You got this. Slow down, right? Take your time. Make sure you're engaging at the top, right? Squeeze and drop. It's up and down. Lift and lower. Stay with me here, 10 seconds left. And then we're moving on right into your crunches, all right? Hips come down to your mat. Just your shoulder blades come up. Hands behind your ears if you can. In three, two, and one. Heels on the floor. Just crunch, right? Chin stays off your chest. I stay right up at the ceiling. In 15 seconds, we're going to turn to our left side, bringing your left elbow down to your mat. You have your left side plank. In five, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead, come up to your left side plank. Left elbow's on your mat. Right, hips in line with your heels. Squeeze your abs. 
Draw your belly button in towards your spine. We're going to drop down to our hip dips in three, two, and one. It's down and up and up. Squeeze at the top, right? Use your obliques to squeeze at the top. Stay with it. Coming back down for your crunch in five, four, three, two, and one. Back down to your mat. Up into your crunch. We got 30 seconds here, and then we take it on our right elbow, all right? Just turn to your right side. I'm going to come to the other end of the mat so I can face you. But just come up on your right elbow, holding your right side plank. In eight, we're almost there. In five, four, three, two, one. Right elbow on your mat. Again, heels lined up with your hips. Draw your belly button in towards your spine. Try not to turn your hips down towards your mat. Take it into your hip dips. Drop it in three, two, one. Down and up, down and up, down and up. Stay with it, stay with it, stay with it. We're here for five. Coming up to your high plank. Hold it in four, three, two, and one. Stack your shoulders over your wrist. Come right up to your high plank. Hold this here. We're just going to hold our high plank, all right? Stacking your shoulders over your wrist. Heels toward the back wall. A little cardio here in 10, right into your mountain climbers, right? It's as slow or as fast as you want it to be. Fingertips pointing just slightly away from your midline. And five, big mountain climbers. Four, three, two, and one. Knees up, abs are tight. We're going to work our shoulders here too, as well as your abs. Heels to the back wall. Staying in your high plank, right? In 10, just that isometric hold at the top, right? Holding your high plank, stacking your shoulders over your wrist. In three, two, one, hips down, hold this here. Brace your abs, right? Keep your hips down. We're working our shoulders here too at the same time, right? We're exhausting our shoulders. In eight, let's do it again. Mountain climbers. Abs are tight in three, two, one. This is your upper body work at the same time as our abs, right? Knees straight ahead. Hips stay down, right? Try not to pike your hips up. 15 seconds to go. We're dropping right down into our push-ups. If you need a second to reset your shoulders, you take it, but it's not anything more than just a couple seconds to reset in five, four, three, two. Hands just a little bit wider. Again, point your fingertips out away from your midline. Take it right into your push-ups, down and up. Again, as slow or as fast as you need this to be, right? Good form, good reps. We don't need a lot of reps, just some good ones, right? Focusing on power and strength and confidence today. In five, we're just gonna shift our hips up, relax your shoulders, come up into down dog, heels to the floor in three, two, one. Let this open up your chest, open up your shoulders. Open up your heart, right? Breathe. Oh, ears are right next to your biceps, right? Dropping your chest down toward the top of your feet. We got 10 seconds left here. Anchor through your heels, right? Straight line up through your spine. Shift forward to your high plank in five push ups in four, three, two, one. Down and up. It's down and up. Pause at the top, option to drop your knees down to your mat. If you wanna modify, right? If you need a modification, drop your knees down to your mat. Keep that straight line up from the back of your knees up to your shoulders, 10 seconds left. We're shifting back to down dog, you got this. You got this, let's stay with it. Let's stay with it in three, down dog, two, and one. Shift your hips up and away from your mat. Drop your chest down toward the top of your feet. Ears between your biceps. 
just relax. Anchor through your heels. Hey, give yourself that moment to breathe. Open your chest. Relax your shoulders. In 10 seconds, we're coming right up to the middle of our mat. Right into your high knees. All right, lifting your knees up to your chest in five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it up. Lift your knees. Squeeze your abs. Right, stay with this. Stay with this. We're finishing with lower body. All right, in 15 seconds, we're going to drop down into our squats. Right, widen your stance. Point your, po- point your toes out away from your midline. In three, two, one. Drop down, squeeze at the top. Drop it in. Lift and squeeze at the top, down and up. Knee stays over your second toe, right? Don't let it bow in. Keep it out in front of your toes, right? If you want to keep your toes pointed straight ahead, that's fine. Don't let your knees bow in towards the middle, right? Knees point straight ahead. Stay back, squeeze your glutes at the top. In three, back to your high knees, two and one. Right back into your high knees. In 15, one more time. Last set of squats. This is it. This is it. Almost there. In five, four, three, two, one. Right back to your squats. Squeezing your glutes at the top. Right, pushing your hips forward, lengthening out your hip flexors, right? Starting in the back of your body as you lift, bring it around to your front. Get a little bit lower. Get a little bit lower. Down. Squeeze your glutes at the top. Squeeze your butt at the top in three. Butt kicks this time. Two and one. Turn this around. Your knees are pointed straight down. In 10 seconds, coming to the top of your mat, we have our reverse lunges. Just your right leg moves. Left leg stays planted in three, two, one. Back to your reverse lunge. Drop and lift. Down and up. In, squeeze at the top. Drop in, come up. In five, right back to your butt kicks. In three, two, one. Right back to your butt kicks. Heels to the back of your legs. Almost there, almost there, almost there. We get to take our reverse lunges on our other side. And then we have our last minute. This is it. This is it. In nine. Right leg stays planted. Left leg travels. In three, two, one. Your reverse lunge on your right side. Up and left. Drop in. Squeeze at the top. Up and back. Lift. Squeeze. Up and down. Up and down. In 10 seconds, we're going to bring this back to the middle of your mat. Right back into your squats. Last minute of your round in three, two, one. Middle of your mat, drop, lift. Down, squeeze, down, squeeze. In and up, in and up. In 10 seconds, you have 20 seconds of squat hops. This is the last 20 seconds of your workout today. In three, two, one. Leave the floor. Leave the floor. Come up and sink. Sink down into your squat, right? Drive down through your heels. This is your last little bit of cardio. Last little bit of work. We got five, four, three, 
two, and one. Good job. You guys have an awesome, awesome day. We'll see you right back here next time.